Interesting things to know about Miss SA 2022 and Davi Nokari. And Davi Nokari was crowned Miss South Africa 2022 at the finale of the pageant held at the Sunbet Arena at Times Square, Pretoria, on Saturday, August 13. This year there are no longer two runners up but just a top two. So, Miss SA 2022 will compete at all three international pageants. If she is unable to, then the runner-up will take on her role. Ayanda Thabithi, from KwaZulu-Natal was the second runner-up. So, who is your new Miss South Africa? Here are five things to know about Ndavi. 1. Ndavi is from Limpopo. Our new Miss SA hails from the town of Zanine in Limpopo. She expressed that it is a groundbreaking moment for her to be chosen to represent her country. For a girl from Gabeza to be seen, embraced, and chosen to represent her country is a groundbreaking moment. A moment that reaffirms that our dreams are valid, regardless of where we come from, she said in her acceptance speech. I am grateful for the women who have gone before me who broke the glass ceiling so I could stand here today empowered, fulfilled, and ready to proudly raise the South African flag high everywhere I go and to shine the light of hope to all South Africans," she continued. 2. She studied at the University of Pretoria. And Davi studied a BCom Investment Management qualification from the University of Pretoria. 3. N. Davi is a consultant for an asset management firm. At the time of her crowning, N. Davi was working as a consultant in an asset management firm in Cape Town. 4. She is 23 years old. The beauty queen is 23 years old. 5. N. Davi will advocate for education equity. Through her reign, the new Miss Essay will advocate for education equity. She also revealed that her failure has inspired her to grow and achieve. Growing up, I struggled with mathematics in school. With every bad result I received, I started believing and accepting that it was something that I just couldn't do until I decided to approach it with a different attitude, she said. I decided that I am the author of my own story and so I redefined myself as a woman who is capable of doing all things she sets her mind to with excellence. This is the attitude that I carry with me into every journey and it has shaped the person I am proud to be today," she continued.